Hello, YouTubers, subscribers, and friends. Man, this is my son, Messy Disc. He was telling me he was leaning on this tray here, this keyboard tray, and he heard a pop sound while he was leaning on it. And next thing you know, there was some, some balls, a bunch of balls laying right here. He didn't know what it was. He freaked out and he came running to me and, and then tell me. I said, what are you talking about? He was all frantic and stuff. And he said, I don't know. Come look. So he shows me. And these are the balls. <laughs> these ball bearings right here. And he threw in the trash. He didn't know what it was. He thought it was some kind of weird magical spell happening or something. He, he didn't know what these are called. And I have uh, got a flashlight and look right in the top on the left side and you can see where the ball bearings go. It's going to focus. Probably not. The ones on the left are there. They're actually in these little holes. And the ones on this side are gone. So I'm going to take this apart and see if I can repair it because it's kind of hard to roll in and out. The right side here sticks. So we'll see if I can repair it. So trying to figure out how to uh, get this tray off. I thought these were screws right here but these are actually rivets. And then I realized that I'm going to have to go underneath here and there's two screws here. And take off this tray. So I took out the screws on both sides. There's two on each side. And then there we go. Oh, more ball bearings fell. Okay, so I found the bearings that fell out. They landed on top here and they were sitting by this ear plug. But this comes out and there's absolutely no bearings in there at all. Oh, there is. There's one, two, four of them there. So he's missing one, two, three, four. And then all the ones go on top are all missing. This one also fell out, the rail fell out, but all the bearings are in it. You see, all the little bearings are in that one. So, I have to figure out how to put these bearings back in and keep them in. I've never done this before. This is a trial and error type thing. Alright, I try to get this thing out but it won't come out. Something's stopping it. A little bump there. Keeping it from coming out. How the heck did he pop those bearings out? I wonder if I can get the bearings back in if they're even going to stay in. Once again because he likes to lean down on the keyboard table. This thing here. I got that railing out by accident. I was trying to slide it back and this pop popped out and it just came out like that and the rest of the bearings fell out. Uh, this is going to be interesting on how to get this back in. Okay, here's what I figured out. I got the top bearings in. Not all of them. He doesn't have all of them. And then I popped one in the bottom here and just snapped it in. And I got to put one under here and then snap it in as I go. It seems to be going in that way. Whether this is going to stay like this, I don't know, because once he puts weight on it again, it might pop out again, so I don't even know if this is even worth repairing. Probably just have to get a whole new sliding thing here. But this is what I figured out so far. I figured out how to get them in and just pop it back in. But I only have three more bearings left, so i got to figure out where I'm going to put them. I can't find any more bearings anywhere. Alright, so i got the bearings in it. It's very... <laughs> It's extremely tough to do this. Uh, I had to spread out the bearings because he doesn't have all the bearings. I can't find any bearings anywhere. And uh, they just kept falling out the bottom. So what I did is put the top in and then one at a time I uh, put one in and then snapped it in and then put another one snapped it in. So now it's in and it's sliding easier than what it was. But I think what he did, I think he bent it and it's going to just pop out again. So I gotta finish putting these side things in. Very greasy on your hands too. Gotta make sure you get you some wet wipes or something. But uh, I think he's just gonna pop this out again because he likes to lean on it. But uh, we'll see. I'm gonna finish putting it back together. This rail is another tricky thing to put in. I, I thought I could just 
pop it in like this, but it wouldn't go in. And what you have to do is, there's a groove. If you can see the groove, where is it? There's a groove right there that you have to put in, like, like this, and then pop it like that, and then slide it in, and then it will go in. And hopefully it will stay in. But this one is still kind of hard to slide back and forth. There we go. Now it's sliding easy. Slide those bearings slide in that groove. But it's, it, like I said, it's missing bearings, so it's kind of wobbly. But this is sliding even much better than what it was because he only had bearings on the bottom. Oh, it wants to fall out now. But once you put the tape, the board across, it will keep pressure on it, keep that in. But I don't know how long it'll last. He'll lean on it again and break it again. All right there, it's all fixed. It's sliding real easy now. But the minute he leans on this again, I think it's just going to fall apart. This by putting this um, table on here forces this one, one and that one out, and it keeps it from popping out on its own. But oh man, this thing is tough to fix. Those bearings keep popping out. But uh, yeah, I just got to tell them don't lean on it. Otherwise, they're going to shoot out again. Well, that's how you fix it. What do you call this? Keyboard table? It's the first time I've ever took uh, this apart, ever seen anything like this before. It's the first for me. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video. Remember to like, comment, subscribe. Don't cause anything, it's free. And I'm gone. Get down, gone.